When operating the jackhammer, it's important to note, always keep the lift assist on the left-hand side between the operator and the jackhammer. A typical mistake made by people the first time they use the lift assist is hovering over the jackhammer. Although this is a common technique when using a jackhammer, it will limit the efficiency of the lift assist. Instead, keep the jackhammer at a safe distance from the body by extending your arms to a comfortable length from the body. Remember, you no longer have to pull the bit out of the ground. Let the lift assist do the work for you. Keep in mind, the lift assist is designed to assist with the lifting of the jackhammer while operating. As a standard procedure, always avoid burying the jackhammer bit. Upon return to the surface, use the lifting rod to pull the bit out of the ground, just enough to clear the debris. If you extend the lifting rod too far, the jackhammer will walk around on the surface. When cutting a perimeter line, we recommend working from right to left. This keeps the distance to the work surface shorter and provides a better view of the lift assist foot. Once the perimeter cut has been made, you're ready to begin breaking up the surface. When operating the jackhammer, lean the hammer in the direction of the next cut, moving right to left, then left to right. Working backwards in a zigzag formation provides a safe and solid surface for the lift assist foot and the operator to work on.